now with your storm team weather. Here's Chief Meteorologist Aaron Ayers. Well, we had a really cool cloudy day here in portions of the Concho Valley. And as we go into the overnight hours tonight, we're going to see some more clouds build back in. And we're also going to see some areas of patchy drizzle throughout the Concho Valley. It's going to be on the cool side for us for the rest of the week. And then the extreme cold moves in this weekend. And yes, you did see that at the bottom of my forecast headlines there. The potential for some snow looks to be increasing for us here in the Concho Valley as we go into the beginning of next week. Almanac today, we made it to 43 for a high. Our average high is around 62 this time of the year. This morning's low was 32 degrees. That's below average for us for this time of the year. So we did make it down to freezing this morning out at Mathis Field. Current temperatures across the region, it's 19 in Oklahoma City, 22 up in Tulsa, 26 in Wichita Falls, 31 in Abilene, 42 here in St. Angelo, 77 down in Del Rio. So enjoying the sun and some warmer weather down there in Del Rio. Here across the Concho Valley, you're going to see a temperature divide here between St. Angelo and then Ozona, where they're sitting in the upper 60s. Sonora sitting in the middle 70s. That's because they saw a little more sunshine today, and that front is stalled out right through here. So they're on the warmer side of it. We're on the cooler side, and especially up towards Abilene, where they're sitting at cooler temperatures than where we are. Speaking of Abilene, if you have plans in the morning to head up towards the Abilene I-20 area, if your plans take you up that way, driving that way, keep in mind that they're expecting some wintry weather overnight tonight in the form of freezing rain, freezing drizzle in the Abilene area. This is a winter weather advisory until noon tomorrow, so keep that in mind. That doesn't include us here in the Concho Valley, but that includes much of the big country. So if you have plans to go up there, check road conditions before heading out tomorrow. Speaking of tomorrow, we're going to see some areas of drizzle as clouds work their way back in tomorrow morning. Temperatures in the 30s for us, maybe even some freezing drizzle to our northern counties, but I think that's going to be mostly confined to the big country for us as we go into tomorrow morning. As we go through the day on Wednesday, still seeing areas of drizzle throughout the day. Temperatures where things are really cold is up towards the Canadian border. It's negative 5 in Billings, 5 in Minneapolis, 13 in Kansas City, 42 here in San Angelo. That cold air is going to be coming our way in the days ahead. This is Saturday for us at 1 o'clock in the afternoon. 27 is what this American model has us at here in San Angelo. And we're going to watch this cold air just spill into Texas here and continue to bring cool weather for us. This is 6 a.m. on Sunday, now saying 11 degrees for us here in San Angelo Sunday morning. Monday morning at 7 a.m., we could be talking about single-digit temperatures or at least temperatures in the teens for us before all this cold air pushes off back to the north and east for us on Tuesday evening. Let's get a look at our extended future cast, some areas of drizzle overnight tonight, some freezing rain possible as we go through Thursday here in the Concho Valley. You're going to be watching for that on Thursday morning. That could include us here in San Angelo. So we're going to watch for slick roads as we go into Thursday morning. As we go into the end of the week, another shot of moisture, another shot of cold air for us. That could result in some more winter weather hazards for us as we go into Saturday. Then another shot at winter weather for us as we go into the beginning of next week. This one could be in the form of snow for us. So we're going to be watching that as we go into the beginning of next week before that all pushes out of the area by the middle of next week. 34 for a low tonight with patchy drizzle. Otherwise, for our Wednesday, 40 degrees, cloudy and patchy drizzle throughout the Concho Valley as we go into the next five days here in the Concho Valley. We're going to see a cooling trend for us as we go through the days ahead and then getting into some near record territory for cold temperatures as we go into the weekend and then again watching for that chance for some snow showers heading into the beginning of next week. We have more KSAN news right after this.